All right, everyone, let's dive into the world of surprising forensic evidence. We all know about fingerprints and DNA, but did you know that bugs can be crucial in solving crimes? Entomologists study insects to determine time of death. They analyze the life cycle of bugs on a body to provide a timeline that can pinpoint when a crime occurred. Mind-blowing, right? Next, we've got pollen. Yes, those tiny grains can link a suspect to a crime scene or even track a victim's last movements. Forensic palynology, the study of pollen, is an underappreciated but powerful tool in crime solving. Ever heard of forensic podiatry? Investigators analyze footprints to determine a suspect's height, weight, and even how they walk. It's like Sherlock Holmes in real life, examining every nook and cranny of a footprint to build a profile. Now let's talk about forensic linguistics. This field examines the language used in ransom notes, threatening messages, or any written communication. Experts analyze word choice, grammar, and syntax to reveal the author's identity. It's like a linguistic fingerprint. And finally, bite marks. Dental impressions left on a victim can be as unique as a fingerprint. Forensic odontologists compare these marks to a suspect's dental records helping to seal the case. So, the next time you think of forensics, remember, it's not just about DNA and fingerprints. The tiniest details can crack the case wide open. Stay curious, true crime fans.